Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Uh, this is going to be an Outlander collection, full try on haul. There is so much to go over in this collection. I am missing a couple pieces, the refined crop zip and the refined full zip. So please stay tuned on my Instagram because I will be posting those like right when I get them. Um, and there are a few other things that I want to try a different size with, which I currently don't have as well. So I'll keep you guys posted on my Instagram if you want to kind of get more information that I don't currently have right now. But I did want to get this try on haul up ASAP because this collection does launch November 23rd next Monday and they're also doing their Black Friday sale at that time so Outlander and Black Friday sale will be going on at the same time Outlander will not be on sale at all but they have so many other products that are up to 50% off so yeah that's kind of all going down the same day so I figured I would mention the Black Friday sale as well it is the only sale that Balance does each year but anyways okay I want to get into this because this is going to be very very long um there is so much to go over. Starting off my stats, I'm 5'2", 113 pounds, bra is 34A, I have 25 inch waist, I don't know my glute measurements, I wear an extra small in all bottoms, small in most tops, but you guys will see I did swap to an extra small for one of the bras and I also want to try an extra small in this as well, so I'll be going over all of that. But, and last thing is if you do choose to use my link, it will be in the description box of this video if you wanted to save it, but also it's going to be all over my Instagram as well. If you choose to use that link, thank you so much, um, it does directly support me and helps me out a lot so thank you and I will be doing a giveaway for people who do choose to use my link so stay tuned for information on that on my Instagram as well okay I think that's it okay also please ignore the mess um, my room is going to be a mess until Outlander launches because this is how it goes literally the full week before launch I have my stuff out and all over the place because uh, responding to DMs and the question box and all of that so anyways I'm not putting it away I'm just gonna keep it out we got some you know laundry over there just let's ignore it okay let's get into probably my favorite piece to start this is the Outlander crew and I'm going to be looking at my handy little book throughout this because I cannot remember all the color names right now I still haven't learned them all and there's a lot so I'm gonna be kind of looking at that but this is the Dune color. I think that the neutrals in this collection are definitely my top choices. Um, but for this crew neck, it is super oversized. We have the super dropped shoulders, which I absolutely just love this top. Um, it's a really, really like soft, stretchy material. It's super hard to explain, but it's like soft, pretty lightweight, but it is like super, super stretchy. A lot of room going on in this top, and this is a small, but I do want to try the extra small because I do think it will still be oversized on me, um, but just a little bit less oversized, if that makes sense. So I currently have it tucked up into my bra, but... This is how it looks normally. There is this drawstring on the bottom so you can cinch it and I just think that looks really, really cute. But normally, this is how it falls. So if you don't want it really cropped, that's the beauty of this piece is that you can make it as cropped as you want. So personally, me, of course, I like it cropped. I personally just love the like oversized crop look. I feel like it's super relaxed but really, really cute. So yeah, this is... um. The small on me. I definitely like the small. Pretty oversized and I do think that I could size down to an extra small. The sleeves are definitely long enough for long limb girls. We have the little balance logo on the back. And yeah, I like don't even know how to describe this because it's honestly one of my favorite pieces that balance has ever made by far. I just think it's such a cute, simple piece, but it's just, it's perfect and it's very much my personal vibe so i love it so much okay there are five colorways launching so we have dune midnight venture which is like this nice dark brown twilight which is kind of like a deep reddish maroon color and then true north which is okay this looks white on camera right now but it's actually kind of like a cream off-white color it's really really cute um i think that these two are my favorites for this i just I'm so into the neutrals and they can go with literally anything. The Outlander Crew, baby. It is by far one of my favorite pieces ever and definitely in my top for this collection. Oh, 
Okay, so next we have another favorite for me. This is the Rome Tank. So it's this like shine, kind of shiny like performance material. I feel like it's the same as the Isla Bra from Waves. And it's basically just this pretty plain um, racerback tank. So it has this little dip down here and it has these like princess seams that kind of like snatch you a little. I just really like this top. I think it's super simple and basic, but that's the beauty of it. I personally am gonna wear this as like a top in my everyday life um, and kind of like dress it up a bit. I'll post a picture right here from my shoot where I wore it with like a blazer and heels and the jogger and like it looks pretty nice. So this to me is an everyday kind of staple piece and I would definitely still work out in this. There is no padding. This is definitely a light support um, top. But I do put little pads in just because I um, like to. It does have a triple lining in the front. So it definitely does give some support and coverage, but I personally just like to add the little pads in. Um, but yeah, I would definitely work out in this, although it is pretty low support, but it is sweat wicking medium compression, all of that. So definitely just a pretty simple top. Oh, I am wearing this in a small. That's my normal um, top size with balance. So I would say this is extremely true to size. I really love this piece. I wouldn't adjust my size in this. Kind of just like a nice little long line tank. You can kind of just like roll it up if you want it to be a little shorter. Sometimes I do that for workouts. So yeah, I think that's kind of it for the Rome tank. But I am obsessed with this piece. Um, definitely one of my favorite tops from Balance. I think I think too much. Stuck inside my mind, can't help but think of stuff. That drives me crazy, maybe because. Oh, and to show you the colors that this comes in, there are five colorways. Again, Dune, we have True North, the like cream color, Mauve Wood. Then we have Midnight and Coastline, which is like this kind of like minty color. This is like a really, really pretty colorway as well. Okay, so now let's get into the leggings. These are the Ascend Pant. I would say these are pretty identical to like the Kingdom fit, feel, all of that. Um, but it is this kind of like nice camo print. There are four colorways in this. So we have Base Camp, which is like this nice dark camo. I think that Base Camp and Desert Rage, the ones that I'm wearing, are definitely my top favorites just because I'm very into the neutrals. Um, but then we also have Ocean Breeze and we have Backcountry, which is like the pink colorway. Honestly, they're all really, really pretty and unique, but I just personally, I'm a neutrals type of gal. So Base Camp and Desert Ridge are definitely my top two. But something new is that the Balance logo on the back is actually embroidered embroidered balance a little bit raised slightly but otherwise i would say fit pretty spot on with the previous ascends like the kingdom um ones so i would say stick to your true to size if you want more compression you could size down like i feel like i could even go a little more compressive but honestly i'm sticking with the extra small that's what i always wear in balance bottom so i would say true to size um whatever you got in kingdom it's pretty much identical sizing to that as the um normal new leggings from balance we have no front seam but we do still have the booty contour seam in the back. I do think that any printed leggings really um, does something for the booty. So I do think that these are super flattering. Um, they are the sweat wicking ascent material. So perfect for workouts, high performance, all of that. And they are squat proof. Am I even in the frame? They are squat proof. Um, so basically kind of similar to the kingdom where it has that base color on the inside. All of these have um, that base color. With the ones that have the light cream color, like this, kind of like the True North color, it does have that on the inside. So it looks like it's white, but it's not. So if you do squat and it reaches maximum like stretch capacity, you are going to see kind of like that showing through a little bit. You may see it showing through, um, but squat proof they are not see-through it is just that lining kind of like showing through if it shears out so see on the blue how you could kind of think that that's skin it's really just the liner showing through <sighs> that's kind of it on that but yeah they are squat proof i have not noticed anything showing through um just that it's the, it is the liner on the inside so i think that's kind of it for these ascend pants i would say pretty like typical ascend pant from balance um honestly the ascend pants are my favorites i think personally so i love these leggings i'm always happy when the sends come out because these are my fave they are perfect for working out but also perfect for lifestyle so 
anything you want to do with these these are the answer you could absolutely dress these up as well if I have any pictures I'll put some here I've been trying to take pictures of like different outfits throughout the weeks but I've been kind of failing so Anyways, I do think that these are definitely a gym staple, but also a life staple. I think that's it for the Ascent pants. Okay, also, I almost keep forgetting that a Midnight Tenacity pant is coming out as well. So, the Tenacity pant. Essentially, if you guys remember Summit, it was like that silky, shiny material. That's basically what these are. They were called Ascends, but since they were so different than normal Ascends, um, they changed the name to Tenacity, just to kind of not get anybody confused. Also, if you have the ones from Summit, these are definitely more true size. They adjusted the sizing on these so that they are not as compressive because the Summit leggings were definitely more compressive than normal. So these are definitely a little more true to size. And then the only difference with these Tenacity pants versus the previous Midnight Tenacity pants that I dropped with the Midnight little mini kind of drop is that it does have the embroidered um, balance logo on it instead of just the triangle. So that's kind of the only difference um, between these and the previous Midnight Tenacity pants. But Overall, these are probably my favorite black pants from Balance. I really like the Tenacity fabric. It's kind of got that silky, like, shiny material. I don't know if you guys can, like, really tell on camera, but it does have some shine to it. I think that these are just the perfect black legging, in my opinion. But yeah, these are a little bit more compressive than the Camo Ascend pant. Not enough, in my opinion, to change your sizing at all, but they are just a little bit more compressive than the Ascend pants that are launching. But yeah. Oh, I to forget and then I drink too much. No, I'm missing a love. When it rains and pours in the shit. Okay, so next let's go over the quest bra. Now I size down to an extra small in this bra. I find it similar to the waves sizing where basically you should size a full size down um, if you want compression and you want it to fit like nice and tight so I I wish I still had this small so I could show you guys but basically I just had a lot of room right here right here it was just like a lot more roomy I had some extra fabric going on so the extra small does fit me a lot better it's this beautiful pretty simple on the front um, it does have that same silky like luxe fabric and then we have the double crisscross kind of thing going on in the back super cute I love the back detailing um, and this is launching in Dune this colorway we have true north twilight midnight and coastline so we have five colorways in this as well it is more of like a long line bra I would say kind of probably similar to the aura bra where it's like a little bit more long lined but it does have removable padding and yeah overall um like I said I size down and it's a very comfortable Fit. we have a lot of room in the back I don't feel super squeezed anywhere it's definitely this is a more compressive fit for me I personally did want to size down in this bra and I did see that a few other people did as well um, so I think that's kind of the overall consensus for the quest bra is that if you do want a more compressive fit or like kind of like a normal compressed sports bra fit size down for me normal size yeah that's kind of it for the quest bra a very just simple but has some cute detailing bra very comfortable, very smooth, silky fabric. I'm here for it. And now we have the Swift Joggers. These are definitely another one of my favorite pieces launching. I feel like I've said that so many times already, but these, I, I'm absolutely obsessed with these. So, okay, essentially, they're really hard to describe. They're like a really lightweight, breathable, stretchy material. And like they kind of have a windbreaker look and feel to them, but they're way softer than like your typical windbreaker fabric. But basically, I absolutely love these joggers because they can be dressed up so much in my opinion. I feel like even though they have that like athletic windbreakery look and like that performance kind of look, they still can be dressed up in my personal opinion. We have, again, five colorways launching for um, these bottoms. This is Terrain. We have Midnight, Ponderoso, which is like a nice like forest green, Twilight, which is that like kind of like deep reddish, and Nautica, which is a navy blue. So these are the women's swift joggers. I'm wearing an extra small, my normal bottom size. I personally love the extra small. I would not change my size. Um, 
And there's also men's Swift joggers launching, which I'll show you as well. But I'm going to try to show you the, the features on a different pair that's not on me because my camera angle is so unfortunate. Basically, we have the drawstring on the inside, so you can kind of cinch, cinch it up as much as you want. Pretty thick waistband, like width-wise. It does also have seaming with the little, like, booty contour. Then the bottoms are kind of like a... Similar to the Select Jogger, in my opinion, like a just like a tight but not super tight um, ankle cuff going on. Okay, my camera keeps running out of memory space, but basically, okay, we have the Balance logo on the back, just this little triangle, and then also on the ankle, there's that little balance. So, yes, it's super hard to explain these because like I want to call them a windbreaker material, but they are a premium version of that. They are not... Like, calling them windbreaker material does not do it justice, but they have kind of that, like, silky look, but they are very, like, breathable, smooth, soft, and comfortable. I, I just, personally, I love these so much, both the men's and the women's. I think that's kind of it for the Swift Joggers. I would stay true to size. Um, maybe if you want them tighter, you could size down. If you want them bigger, you could size up. But I feel like these are a more relaxed version of joggers, whereas for me, the extra small select jogger fits kind of not skin tight but it's definitely more like form fitting than these are i definitely have like some room in my thighs and stuff so i think it's kind of personal preference and just like your body type and what you think um you would want but i am here for the extra small my normal size i'm sticking to it and yeah these are just one of my favorite pieces these are not super moisture wicking um i haven't worked out in them personally but i have dropped water on them and it does show up kind of right right away so that is something to bear in mind they're not the most moisture wicking um but i will say they do dry quickly so like if i spill water on myself it dries up pretty quick but it does show up instantly so yeah just something to think about i personally don't care about sweat or anything like that but if you do um yeah that's what i've noticed with these but overall i'm absolutely obsessed with I wish my life was a little bit easier. I wish she never brought my heart so I could speak to her. I wish the kid who cut my hair didn't sleep with her. And I wish I felt good when I was leaving her. But I okay, now let's just go over the men's Swift Jogger. So I'm actually wearing these in an extra small. And as you can tell, the fit is not that different in my opinion. I don't know if it's like with the extra small specifically or if it's all sizes. They are pretty similar to the women's sizing in my opinion. Again, at least for the extra smalls. Like... I don't really notice too, too much of a difference. These are a little bit looser and roomier, but I still think that they look pretty good for like my normal women's size. But the small differences with these are the waistband is a little bit thinner than the women's. They're not as high waisted. They do still have the uh, drawstring that you can kind of cinch the waist with. The ankle cuff, let me see if I can figure out a good way to show you guys this. So the ankle cuff, First of all, they have zippers at the ankle, and the ankle cuff is like a super thin, like scrunched look instead of that like thicker um, solid band at the bottom for the women's. So those are kind of like the main differences that I've noticed. And then for the men's, the it just has a small little balance logo right here. But yeah, so these are the men's. I absolutely love the men's too because I do think that the pattern is really cool in the jogger. Um, and all of the joggers for men come in the same pattern as the women. So I only have the Desert Ridge colorway personally, but it does come in Base Camp, Backcountry, Ocean Breeze, and then Midnight as well. Just a solid black. But yeah, here's the men's joggers. I love good pattern going on. I think that these are like really, really nice. Um, and again, I like dress them up kind of intensely and I feel like it kind of worked. So yeah, I don't know. I feel like these are very versatile, both the men's and the women's joggers. They can really be kind of turned into whatever you want to turn them into, outfit-wise. So my heart broke, put me in a dark place, no charcoal. At the bottom of the bottle full of salt, we roll. I can't run from the demons, they follow me. Leave me alone. I don't care what she's doing, I don't need to know. Bro, said he heard some, cool, keep it. So we have the beloved Muse tee. This is just the oversized cropped tee that did come out with Kingdom. This is a small on me. I like to stick with the small. Um, I do sometimes like roll it up a little bit extra or I'll tuck it up under my sports bra for a more cropped look But I personally like the way that this small looks on me um, There's just this simple little 
cuff detailing. I like how the bottom is like a natural roll. And then we just have the Balance logo on the back. This is like a super simple um, top, but I do think that you can pair it with so many different things that I do. I think they're super cute. I, de I love them. Um, and they're a nice, like soft, comfy, relaxed material. Just a, a solid oversized crop t-shirt, in my opinion. Um, and this does come in five colorways. So, Dune. I'm trying on like all of the Dune ones, basically. And I'll go through all the other colors at the end. Uh, True North, Mauve Wood, Coastline, and Midnight. So, that's the five colorways launching. I personally really like the neutral ones. I feel like they can go with everything. Um, so, yeah, those are probably my top favorites for the muse tea but i just really like this tea i think it's super simple can be paired with so many things me I, read it though. I can't even be mad no more I'm done. can't even be sad no more I'm see that's why i don't hey. drink so much because hey. i can't help okay it. so next we have the echo tea i'm wearing this in a small i cannot remember what collection that these launched with so we have the like scooped hem kind of gives you like that cinched part in your waist um and yeah it's just like a nice short sleeve Super basic tee, but really cute if you want the full length. It does have these like um, seaming details in the back. I can't remember what collection the, the, this tee launched with, but these have been here before. But yeah, super simple tee. I personally am annoying and I always crop all my stuff. So I do the little tie front. I think this is super cute. Again, we got Dune, True North, <laughs> Mobwood, Midnight, and coastline. So yeah, this is the Echo T. Think I so much. Stuck my can't help but think of stuff. That drives me crazy, maybe because I think the Trek shorts. These are like the best little lounge shorts. I have seen people work out in these. I personally don't think I would. These are kind of just like a really nice, comfortable lounging around short for me personally and what I like to wear to the gym, but you could definitely work out in these. Um, these have these zip pockets on the side and I want to show you the waistband detailing. So the back has this like ribbed, this is literally so stretchy. Um, and then the front kind of just has this like normal, super soft waistband look. So I don't know if it's hard to tell when they're on, but these are an extra small on me. These are my normal size. Um, I don't think I would size up or down personally. I think these are like the perfect comfortable fit. I think if I sized up, the waistband would be a little bit too big on me because these have a lot of stretch to them. But yeah, these are like super soft, very comfortable, stretchy, the, like the perfect lounge short um, in my opinion. And again, people, I've seen people working on these. I personally, like these aren't my typical like gym short, but you know, you can do whatever you want. So colorways, five again. I have Terrain on right now. We have Ponderosa, the forest green, Midnight, Nautica, and Twilight. Just a super nice, simple lounge short. I can't, I don't like know how to go into detail about them, but they definitely seem like a little bit luxurious with the way that they are. Um, and they just, they feel incredible. I feel like it's so hard to describe things without you feeling them, but yeah. Go out to forget and then I drink so much. We are almost done, I promise. Um, so this is the Ease dress. I have this in the color Terrain. So this dress, I'm wearing an extra, extra small. Basically, um, they're supposed to be more of a kind of like relaxed, not necessarily oversized, but definitely just more of like a roomy, easy, simple, flowy, comfortable dress. Um, but I personally wanted it to just be a little bit more like accentuating, I guess, on me. Um, so I did size down to the extra, extra small. So I actually don't have all the colorways in my size. I am going to ask for one of them being extra small just so I can show you guys the difference. So again, stay tuned on my Instagram for that. But basically, it is like just a really comfortable, sh like stretchy, soft dress. It does have obviously this little drawstring waistband. I personally really like to cinch it like as tight as it can go. <laughs> I think it just looks really flattering that way. Um, it kind of has this wide neckline, which I think is super flattering. These pockets, so convenient. Um, and then as you can see, the bottom kind of has 
the scoop bottom and yeah this is the ease dress this is just a really like simple basic comfortable dress you could throw on some booties you could throw on some sneakers whatever you want to do um i feel like this dress is very versatile and you can kind of just do a lot of things with this dress um but overall it's just a really comfortable like easy throw it on and you're good to go type of dress so i want to tell you guys the colorways that it's coming in since i can't show you all of them so we have terrain on right now coastline twilight ponderosa nautica and midnight so this one comes in six different colorways and again i'm wearing an extra extra small as you can see it's really not like super small on me in the harmony dresses i did do an extra small and i feel like those fit me well but since this is more of kind of like a flowy ish oversized ish not totally dress i size onto an extra extra small and i feel like i prefer this fit i really like this fit so yeah it's kind of it for the ease dress i try to swim the shore but girl i'm stuck i pray that rescue comes and never does it never does okay and the last last thing is the maker hood these are coming back so these are the oversized sweatshirts from balance i think was oasis i think oasis was when they launched these um these are different from the verse hood which is the ones that have the like cowl neck this is just a normal hoodie neckline and it is marketed as oversized so this is a men's medium on me very big very comfortable if you were planning on getting this as a girl um and wanting that oversized look you don't really need to size up i have a small from oasis and that one still is super oversized on me but i got a medium just because i wanted to see and this is perfect in my opinion for an oversized look um definitely gonna wear this snowboarding this season but i love these hoodies so much they're nice and thick durable so soft and comfortable um i love the like subtle branding on here and yeah, here's the last item from me. The Maker Hood, baby, they're back. Um, and wait, let me see. This comes in five colorways. We have Ponderosa, Terrain. Yeah, this is Terrain. Um, and then there's Nautica, Dune, and Midnight. So there is a lighter tan as well, the Dune color. So I have Terrain in this. And yeah, I think that's it, guys. Okay, now I'm going to take a little break and go eat, and then I'm going to come back and put on every single colorway and every single piece and do a little montage. But thank you guys so much for watching. Um, stay tuned, like I said, on my Instagram. I will be doing the question box as normal. I'm going to set aside like three days to answer all of your questions. Um, and yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope that this try-on was helpful and all of that. So I love you guys, and I will see you in my next video. Bye, guys! I think I think too much. Stuck inside my mind, can't help but think of stuff. That drives me crazy, maybe cause I think of us Go out to forget and then I drink too much Now I'm missing a love When it rains it pours in this shit like a flood I try to swim to shore but girl I'm stuck I pray that rescue comes and never does It never does, no, no, no. I wish my life was a little bit easier I wish she never brought my heart so I could speak to her I wish the kid who caught my hair didn't sleep with her And I wish I felt good when I was leaving her But I needed her, so my heart broke Put me in a dark place, no charcoal At the bottom of the bottle full of salt I can't run from the demons, they follow me Leave me alone I don't care what she doing, I don't need to know Bro, said he heard something, cool, keep it low Shorty sent me a test, how you read it though? I can't even be mad no more I'm done. Can't even be sad no more I'm See, that's why I don't drink so much Cause I can't help but think of I think too much Stuck inside my mind, can't help but think of stuff That drives me crazy, maybe cause I think of fuck Go out to forget and then I drink too much Now I'm missing a love When it rains and pours in this shit like a flood I try to swim to shore but girl I'm stuck I pray that rescue comes and never does It never does, no, no. I think I think too much.
stuck inside my mind, can't help but think of stuff That drives me crazy, maybe cause I think of us Go out to forget and then I drink too much Now I'm missing a love When it rains it